方，愿你的生命宁静温暖如海洋。欢迎全球的观众朋友准时收看《姻缘小聚》。我们在今天的节目当中，我们非常的难得为大家请到的是一位呃非常优秀的运动家，是一位呃体操教练啊，他同时也是一位心灵导师，也是一位呃作家。他的这个书籍呢，已经翻译了呃将近有二十九种语言呢。我想可能很多的朋友都看过他的这个著作，也看过他的这个电影啊，就是《深夜加油》。在遇见苏格拉底，嗯，我想里面有非常多的一些非常睿智的一些呃话语，深深的震撼着我们。是，但米尔曼在台湾呃推出他的作品，呃，当然《深夜加油站遇见苏格拉底》也有了。漫画的版本，那么另外一本就是《录制者的心灵法则》。那么非常开心能够在节目中来访问到丹米尔曼先生。是 ，Thank you, Dan, come here。谢谢，谢谢丹。是，我们首先就请丹跟我们来谈一谈哦。我们认为您是一位呃身心灵合一呃的一位实践家啊、哦。我们知道知道你在早期的时候就发展自己的这个身体啊，然后成为一位非常优秀的运动员，是不是可以先跟我们谈谈身心灵合一当中身体的一个重要性，好吗 ？What I practiced when I was young was a gradual awakening.、Uh, I came to realize that the physical skills alone were not enough because many athletes had good physical skills,、uh, but I had to also train mental focus uh, and. Uh, A certain uh, elevation uh, to accept my emotions, but not let them stop me. I felt fear often in gymnastics as part of the training.、Mm -hmm. um, so over time, I, I came to understand that I had to train body, mind, and spirit. It became a whole.、Mm -hmm. uh, there is nothing special; just rigorous training.、Mm -hmm. uh, that was the key.、Uh, When obstacles came up, internal obstacles like self-doubt or fear, or external obstacles like an injury,、uh, I just continued persisting as best I could. No different from anyone else. But I do recommend that not not that we dedicate our life to our sport, but that we dedicate our sport to our life、uh, as a path or a way、uh, of personal growth. And so it became a larger game. It wasn't just about winning or losing; it was about developing myself as a whole person. This part can you talk more about? Yes,、uh, I'm glad you asked because this is a key idea of a way.、Uh, in, in Japan, it's do. In China, of course, dao.、Mm -hmm. um, the idea that we don't do things just for themselves.、Um, relationships are a way or path. Um, to maintain a good, strong relationship,、uh, business is a path or a way.、Mm -hmm. So when we do something as a way or a means to a larger end, even a bad day in the gymnasium, or in a relationship, or in business, can be a very good day、mm -hmm. in terms of learning about ourselves and getting stronger.、Mm -hmm. I find that every adversity、uh, can lead to、uh, strength, perspective, and wisdom.、Mm -hmm. So. I came to understand that those difficult days were part of training. I took them in stride and recognized them even as opportunities,、mm -hmm. uh, as a form of spiritual weightlifting to strengthen our spirit. 是不是请这个呃丹来跟我们谈一谈这本《深夜加油站遇见苏格拉底》啊？呃，因为他也这个以这个电影的这个形式和所有的这个观众见面，所以很多人都对他印象非常的这个呃深刻哈、啊。是不是可以跟我们谈谈？这是一部半自传性的一个著作、啊，嗯，里面讲到的这个苏格拉底啊，是不是也可以跟我们谈谈他对于你的一个这个影响是什么？好吗？ Well, for your viewers who are not、uh, familiar with、uh, the old man I called Socrates after the ancient Greek,、um, uh, he was、uh, an unusual man I met in a in a gas station、um, in 1966 while I was still a university student,、um, and he was based on a real、um, real man,、uh, and he had a certain、uh, humor, a certain lightness, the way he carried himself. I didn't understand it. I didn't have words for it.、Mm -hmm. uh, but he had something I wanted, and I, and I had. So I, I stuck around and started to help out、uh, in the gas station and to learn from him.、Mm -hmm. Not everyone has a teacher just like that.、Mm -hmm. 
Um, but for me, it, he represented that, uh, that guide who showed me by his example as much as by his words. 是，可不可以多谈一谈？就是说，当你碰到苏格拉底的时候，你对于哪一些东西对你来讲，一对一个亲人讲是深深吸引的？那你觉得是你缺乏的这个部分 ？There's a story of、uh, centuries ago when the, the Buddha was walking in the woods. He, a wanderer stumbled upon him, and the wanderer didn't know who the Buddha was, but he was fascinated with him, and he finally asked the Buddha,、uh, "Are you a wizard?" And the Buddha said, "No, no." He said, "Well, are you a king or a great warrior?" And Buddha said, "No." And he said, "But what is it that makes you different from anyone I've ever met?" And the Buddha said, "Oh," he said, "I'm awake. I'm awake." And that is what fascinated me about the old man.、Uh, mm-hmm. um, now, one difference in real life and what was depicted in my book is I actually had broken my leg in many pieces、mm-hmm. before I met him. And I think that injury opened me up to life's bigger picture, to asking bigger questions about what is life for. And I think that opened my eyes to finding him as a teacher, because many people saw him,、uh, drove through the station, but they just saw an old gas station attendant.、Mm-hmm. So I think my eyes were sensitized, my heart was sensitized, to recognize there's something about him, and. Because he appeared fairly ordinary to anyone else, I think.、Um, but for me, he became a, a catalyst,、uh, and other people find another teacher.、Uh, there's a saying that there is one light but many lamps, and that is true for me. He was one of many lamps. 我们也想啊谈一下，就是说，在这个几个不同版本的这个深夜加站遇见苏格拉底啊，呃，就我们现在有看到的是原来的你的文字版，其实三十多年前就已经非常畅销的书了，然后变成电影，然后变成呃一个漫画的这个版本了、啊。我想它可能每一个版本都有不同的使命，那么也许漫画版本对新的年轻人是一个很好的一个切入的工具。可不可以谈谈你自己？希望透过这样的一些版本，跟不同人去分享一些什么样的一个智慧。Over the years,、uh, thousands of people have said your book changed my life.、Mm-hmm. And I want to ask, and I have asked people, what do you mean by that? How did it change your life? And I, I've come to understand what they're really saying is it helped expand my perspectives. Um, it helped remind me of life's higher promise and bigger picture.、Mm-hmm. That life will be okay. That even through the difficult times, there is a higher, higher drama going on.、Mm-hmm. That we're all here to draw closer to spirit, and to understanding ourselves and our world.、Mm-hmm. Uh, and I think that is what has affected people.、Uh, somehow,、uh, the words in my book have touched so many people.、Mm-hmm. I feel blessed many times over. Um, 是不是也请戴哥跟我们谈谈？嗯，是什么样的原因啊，让你从一位这么优秀的这个运动家，然后转变成一个心灵导师啊？那也可以跟我们谈一谈这个心灵，它是不是是没有极限的？对于你来讲，所以您花了这么长的这个时间去呃钻研。Yes, I sincerely believe it's a continuous journey.、Uh, sometimes one, two steps forward, one step back.、Um, I think it's true for all of us. Stumbling toward the light.、Uh, people have asked me、uh, today if I have mastered all that I teach, and the answer is no. I have not, but I'm sincerely practicing, and that's all I could ask of anyone.、Um, I think I'm a good example, though not a perfect one.、Uh, but again, I continue to practice.、Mm-hmm. And as far as the transformation goes,、mm-hmm. I think my life has been like anyone's—a natural process of growth and learning.、Mm-hmm. Uh, I think it's more the world, people's perception of me.、Uh, as more people have read my books, that has changed. But I don't play the role of a great spiritual guru. <laughs>、uh, I love to teach, and I once taught sports. Now I teach、uh, different skill sets, principles for living, and I continue to do so. I've always wanted to ask a question. Actually, 
，嗯，每一个人在在不管是追寻自己的路，或是面对生活的时候，他都有很多的矛盾跟害怕，尤其这个社会的价值观，呃。跟你追寻的东西是不一样的时候，你怎么去看待这件事情，或者你怎么去，去去去跟这些人来说你的价值观，或者说你怎么样去面对你的害怕 ？Yes, whenever we go through a paradigm shift, whether it's from a conventional to a more transcendental view that others may not share, there is a sense of loneliness for a little while, of isolation, but then we can find a larger spiritual family. We meet new people. We attract new people to us, who perhaps share some of those views. But I think it's important not to have an in-group and an out-group. To recognize we're all in this together. Everyone's on a spiritual journey. It's just that some are more aware of it and some are not yet aware of it. Uh, 也想请 Dan 来跟我们谈谈啊。您在这工作坊当中讲到了和平之心、勇士之道哈。可以跟我们聊聊您心中所诠释的勇士是什么？似乎在这个现在的社会当中，很缺乏勇士的精神啊。我们可不可以跟我们聊聊 ？Thank you for asking that question, because many people wonder about the term peaceful warrior. How can you be both? And it really refers to the idea that we're all striving to live with a peaceful heart, but there are times in our life that we need a warrior's spirit. Because it takes courage to live in the world, it takes courage to love in the world. There's an everyday heroism in life, and so peaceful warrior is a balanced idea that we live peacefully, but we also sometimes need to bring courage and compassion into life. 嗯，是，我想，呃，很多的心灵的路程里面都会面临到一件事情，就是如何面对你的恐惧，哈。那我想，一个勇士应该也是要面对他的恐惧的。可以谈谈这个部分。Yes, a famous boxing coach in America once said that heroes and cowards feel exactly the same fear; they just behave differently. So the way that I teach is not so much about fixing our insides, not so much about just having positive thoughts. Or feeling the right emotions like courage and love、mm -hmm. and confidence,、mm -hmm. it's more focused on what we do in life, how we behave, and in a way this simplifies life. We don't have to constantly be wondering, "Oh, I hope I don't have the wrong thought or feeling." We just focus on what will I do now, and to behave with courage and love, whether or not we happen to be feeling like it.、Mm -hmm. 也请大家来跟我们谈谈，就是嗯， um, 在工作坊当中，希望带给呃。Uh, 体验者什么样子的一种价值啊？那你所相信的是什么？呃，是一种哲学吗？譬如说是东方的能量气，还是一种西方的一种进取呢？啊，一种积极的一种行为，可不可以跟我们谈谈你所相信的？你希望能够让学员能够体会的是什么？在这个工作坊当中？呃、uh, ，It's quite challenging to summarize.、Uh... Yeah. Uh, what I teach, because after writing 17 books,、um, there are many facets to the way I express.、Um, in my workshops and seminars, I often give a sampling of different elements for body, mind, and spirit:、uh, physical exercises, breathing, but also ways of understanding ourselves more deeply. Because the better we know ourselves, the wiser choices we're able to make in life. So it's not so much about my instilling my beliefs on anyone else. I remind people I'm not here for them to trust me. I'm here to help them trust themselves. 嗯嗯，是，我们也想知道您的这本《录制者的心灵法则》啊。那么，想跟大家来分享的一些什么样的一些观念？在里面有列了十二个这个心灵法则。I often explain to my students and readers that. The way that I teach is not simply based on my opinions. My opinions are no more valuable than anyone else's. I try to found the way I teach on universal or spiritual laws, as real as the law of gravity, which helps us attune to reality, how it actually works. Because there are many beliefs floating around,、uh, some of them more realistic, some less.、Uh, so these laws, twelve laws that. I'm taught by an ageless woman sage in the laws of spirit, 
help us to uh, remind us, they're, they're essential reminders of balance and process, doing things step by step, bringing and living in the present moment. So I learned them in the natural world in this book, uh, and they're good reminders for living wisely and well. Sure. 在这些呃心灵法则当中，呃，我有几个比较有兴趣的，一个是沉浮的这个法则啊，呃，是不是可以就这个部分来跟我们谈谈你的一个经验，好吗 ？The law of surrender has been called the first law of spirit, because if we,、um, stress happens in our lives when the mind resists what is, and by learning to flow with reality,、uh, life goes so much smoother. Uh, life comes at us in waves.、Uh, all we can do is learn to become a surfer、mm -hmm. and ride the waves.、Mm -hmm. And this is what the law of surrender is about.、Mm -hmm. It is not passive.、Mm -hmm. uh, it's not tolerating injustice.、Mm -hmm. Rather, it is like a good martial artist.、Mm -hmm. You learn to go with the force and make use of it, rather、mm -hmm. than resisting life.、Mm -hmm. Uh, and this is、uh, can change one's life profoundly.、Mm -hmm. uh, it's a very important law, and I'm glad you asked me about it.、Mm -hmm. One definition of love is recognizing the same consciousness in another person as in yourself. That same light shining through all our different eyes.、Uh, the law of unity or togetherness、um, is a transcendental law, because conventionally speaking, we're separate beings. If I hurt my foot, it doesn't hurt anyone else. They don't feel it. So physically, we're separate, emotionally and mentally. But from a transcendental view. Uh, we are that same consciousness, that same light,、uh, in all these different bodies and minds,、mm -hmm. and in that understanding,、uh, we are, in a sense, one being, one family.、Mm -hmm. This is such an important concept for the world today、mm -hmm. uh, to understand. We have more in common than we do、uh, differences.、Mm -hmm. Oh, if if I could add, if、yeah. I could add one、sure. thing.、Um, This sounds very cosmic, what I've been saying, but practically speaking, we can apply the law of unity. For example, in sports, when I play tennis, there is no opponent on the other side of the net.、Uh, there is only my student and my teacher. I can't play the game without the, the other person. So there is a sense of unity there,、uh, being one another's students and teachers. So it changes from. A、competitive mind to collaborative mind. So there are very practical applications of these laws. They're not just philosophy. 是，我想呃请教一下这个行动法则，因为对于很多人来说啊，这个行动法则其实是一个，<笑>呃，是一个蛮大的一个障碍。你可不可以谈谈它的重要性 ？I agree completely. This is the major challenge in life: turning what we know into what we actually do. And the law of action reminds me of a quotation by Bodhidharma, who said, "All know the way, but few walk it." And the key to turning what we know into what we do. Whether it's exercising every day or eating a balanced diet, is to start small. We can dream big, but start small and then connect the dots.、Um, so uh, I do. Uh, I begin my exercises every day with a, a routine that takes less than four minutes a day.、Mm. Simple is powerful. Rather than making big resolutions, if we start small, if we begin to meditate、uh, for. One minute a day, or 15 seconds. It's at least it's a beginning, and this is the key for turning knowledge into action. Starting small. 
。那我我也想请丹来跟我们谈谈，嗯，你是不是可以跟我们谈谈，就是你觉得人类他在展现自我最有力量的时刻是什么？因为我深深对他有一个对你有一个很深的一个着迷啊，就是我觉得你似乎可以在当下就能够展现一个很强大一个力量哈、啊，这个好像是一个现在法则，活在当下哈、啊，这个部分是不是我也我也在电影当中有有感受到这样子的一种心得啊？可不可以跟我们谈？你觉得人类能够展现最强大的一个心灵的一个力量，你觉得是什么样子一种状态或者是一个时刻？ Yes,、uh, in in the laws of spirit, I was taught, I was taught the law of presence by a cat.、Uh, I thought I was reading the cat's mind、uh, in the book,、um, because cats are masters of living in the present moment. If you've ever tried to discipline a cat for being mischievous, it looks at you like, "What? That was then. This is now."、Um, but in terms of the law, in order to have presence in life, we have to be present.、Um, And the most important moment to me is this moment.、Mm. It's the only one that exists.、Mm. And the most important people in my life are the ones I'm with at that moment. Now I can't say honestly that I'm intensely practicing all the time.、Mm -hmm. I certainly am with you here now.、Mm -hmm. But there are moments that I get sleepy and and stumble.、Mm -hmm. um, so it comes and goes.、Mm -hmm. But it is quite an important、uh, law because it. It brings us back to the reality of this moment, and that's the essence of the law of presence. And I go into how to do that more in the course of the book and the story. 我们要非常谢谢丹来呃节目当中来分享您的一些心灵智慧啊，在最后呃有没有任何的一些话语或者是问题我们没有问到的啊？所以呃，但是您希望透过这个电视节目来表达的啊，在这时刻可以跟我们大家来聊一下最后的一些补充。I thought you've done a wonderful job of bringing up some important points.、Um, if if I have to summarize,、uh, I can tell a brief story about two friends.、Uh, one is named、uh, Aldous Huxley. He was a writer, a professor, and when he was near death,、uh, he had studied the global heritage of spiritual practices、mm -hmm. uh, deeply. And when he was dying, a good friend of his said.、Uh, Is there any way you can summarize all that you've learned over the years? And he said, "I'm a little embarrassed to say I can summarize it all in about six words. Try to be a little kinder, and perhaps that is the most,、uh, the best practice of all." And one thing, one thing I would add to that is to remind people、uh, when they feel lost,、uh, when they feel like they're slipping backwards. Is to remember that wherever they step, the path will appear beneath their feet. And sometimes, when we think we're slipping backwards, we're only backing up to get a running start. Oh, 讲得太好了。<laughs> <laughs> <laughs> 我们要非常谢谢丹来到这个节目当中来分享您的一个书中的一个这个智慧。希望下次有机会能够来到台湾的时候，一定要到节目当中来。非常感恩丹。呃，我们的节目时间到了，我们要非常谢谢你的收看。我们更要感谢的是潘导播以及大电视现场所有的工作人员、应援小聚，下次再聚，感恩。